So you might be trying to figure out how you can get a voice changer on your particular MetaQuest. Now, this is a pretty interesting process because there's a couple of different ways to do it, but the main way to go ahead and do this is by going through and actually using your PC. So you will have to actually have some sort of like PC, you know, in order to actually do this. So keep that in mind. You can either use a Mac or a Windows PC for the most part. Now, what you're going to want to do here is you want to go and download the voice mod application. So you want to go ahead and basically, you know, connect and, you know, download the voice mod application as a software. So many people use it. It's completely free as well, which is pretty cool. So you want to go ahead and download this particular app. And once it's installed, you want to go ahead and configure voice mod directly on your particular quest. So go ahead and plug in and, you know, essentially plug in your particular, you know, quest headset to your PC. You want a long enough wire that you can actually use it and, you know, kind of use your headset at the same time. So go ahead and do that. And you want to go and make sure whether it's the Quest 2 or Quest 3 that your computer can actually recognize that particular headset. Now, when you do that, you want to go ahead and change the input, whatever game you're using, if you're using VR chat, or whatever, after you're done setting up the audio, you want to change that input from, you know, your particular you know headset to the voice mod in that game that you're playing. So try that out. Then what you're going to want to do then is you want to go ahead and test your audio, make sure it works. You can talk with your voice and you should be able to go and see it that within your particular thing, you should be able to see it come up. Now, what you can do there is you can now play in the metaverse with your particular voice mod app. And that's pretty much all you're really going to have to do. It really is that basic. And that's essentially how it's done. Now, if you have any questions or thoughts, you can always check out the voice mod app and the voice mod software. And that's another thing you can try doing as well. But for the most part, that kind of covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly, everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.